at least 50 illegal immigrants had been landed in Tolaviac area in the last 24 hours on four boats in Cabo de las Huertas, Calais Ferris, Los Locos and the other in Tabarca, all are said to be of Algerian nationality. The first of the boats arrived at Cabo de las Huertas around 5 o'clock yesterday morning with six people on board, five men and a woman who was pregnant. The woman was taken to the General Hospital in Alicante for a more in-depth health examination, although the sources from the Red Cross said that she was in good condition. The second patera landed in Toravieca shortly after 5 a.m. with another 16 people on board, this time at Los Locos Beach. There, instead of running away, they simply sat down and waited for the arrival of the Torrevieca local police who guarded them until they were taken away by the civil guard. The state of health of all the arrivals was checked by members of the Red Cross and of the party of 16, two claimed to be minors. A third boat, this time a motorboat with 12 immigrants on board, arrived at Calaferis, also in Torrevieca. Here the immigrants ran into the town. They were disembarked from the boat by two people who remained on board and then put back out to sea. Those immigrants that were taken into custody were all moved to the port of Alicante where they will undergo medical examinations by the Red Cross to determine their state of health and where PCR tests will be carried out to check if anybody is infected with COVID. The fourth boat was intercepted in the vicinity of Tabac with 15 people on board where it appears to have been stranded. The vessel was assisted by a vessel from Maritime Rescue. According to sources from the Red Cross, all of the immigrants were in good health. The pregnant woman was taken to the hospital due to her condition, while one of the men who was aboard the boat on Lost Locust Beach was also taken to a health centre due to a problem with his nose due to a recent operation.